Hi students! Um, a quick video for practicing some difficult pronunciation changes today, especially a piece that we have been practicing a lot in our distance education classes recently, which is the difference between the long E and the short I sound, especially seen in the words eat and it. Um, with a focus on the shape of your lips for this pronunciation. So let's jump right into it. We're starting with the word bite, which has the I, I, the long I vowel. And you'll see that my mouth is a lot larger and wider for this long I, by, bite, bite. And then we are changing to the short I, the I, for bit. The past of bite is bit, bite, bit. And watch the change in my lips as I say bite, bit, bite, bit. You will see the I, I, the long I has a much larger mouth, bit has a much narrower and wide lips. Then we change to bet, the short E sound, eh, eh, bet. The mouth is a little bit larger for bet compared to bit. Bet, bit. Bite, bit, bet. And finally, our E, E, which is a tight, wide lip. Beat, beat. I bet, I beat. All four words, bite, bit, bet, beat. Did the dog bite you? He bit me. I bet you got bit. Did you beat the game? Remember always that one great strategy, one great technique for practicing your pronunciation is to use your phone in a selfie video to record. Watch the shape of your lips. Compare to the shape in my video. Listen to my pronunciation, pause. Listen to your pronunciation. Are they the same? Are they different? You can record yourself saying these sentences. You can record yourself using a single word to make the comparison like beat, bit. Beat, tight, tight cheeks, wide lips. Beat, bit, each, itch, eat, it. You should see a large difference in my cheeks as well as my lips. Beat, bit, each, itch, eat, it. And then always putting them into some sentences, putting them into a paragraph. Um, record yourself speaking a paragraph, listen to it compared to mine. Did you bet on the game yesterday? Which team beat Barcelona yesterday? Did they beat them by a lot or just a little bit? I think that player was bit by a dog. I bet he is unhappy about the bite. As always, leave some sentences in the comments below if you want to practice any of this vocabulary in context. Take a video of yourself, compare to mine. It's the best way to analyze your own pronunciation. Until next time, students. Bye.